I have this experience that people are really negative before they're positive. You were saying that the, the media um, is, a, is a mirror to our world. Because I see the media usually, I mean, I've kind of stopped watching television. I watch the Gruen Transfer, I watch, you know, I watch q and I watch Australian Story. I'm a little bit of a mom. But because I'm tired of seeing the negativity that's portrayed in the media 24-7, and I see that, is that, is that just the ugly mirror of how we are in our world? Are we just so, can we just not say a positive word? Because being an originally an American girl, but living here 25 years, I say, hi, how are you? Every day, to almost everybody I meet. And people are like, what, what are you talking to me? What's your take on that? Is it the media and the human, or the human and then the media? Um, no, I think, I think there's two things. The first thing is, it's really, really, really good that the news is so incredibly negative because the nature of news is that it is the unusual. So we are really, really seriously fucked if the news became really, really positive because that would mean <laughs> that good, ordinary things happening all the time was really, really unusual. So what we need to recognise is that by its very nature, news appears depressing. But think about it, that's good because it means that stuff is really rare. Um, I think that also all narratives... Oh, wait, I just caught up to you then. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's, like... it's, it's really straightforward when you think about it. It's called news, people, for a reason. Um, but there, there, it's also that narrative and story is always a journey from darkness into light. Mm -hmm. It is never light plus light plus light plus light. There is nothing duller... Look at most advertising. Most advertising tries to be relentlessly positive. It tries to show you really lovely, pitchy keen people doing really lovely, pitchy keen things. And they're incredibly dull, patronising and awful. So, personally, having spent my life fighting people who want to do everything pitchy keen, I'm extremely keen on the negative. Give me a bit of grim and I'm a happy girl. <laughs> Because I think that's reality and it's what we live for and it's the way stories develop. And I think if you watch most drama, if you watch a lot of things on television, even some of the reality TV shows, you know, there's good and bad. And you can emphasise the bad or you can enjoy the good. And it's the combination we need. But how do you think that plays into them? I'm gonna, can we, is the microphone ready to open up so we can pass to the floor? We have a microphone we're ready to use. And we're ready to rock. <laughs> but how do you think that that affects bullying? I mean, if everything's, you know, if we're seeing all this all the time, like this <gasps> bad stuff, and people are kind of down, and, and it's, people say it about the media all the time, how does that affect well, bullying? Well, you know... And I'd love your take on it as well, Sam, if you wouldn't yeah, mind. Bullying, look, bullying to some extent is part of life. It's the exercise of power. And, uh, you know, let me ask everybody in the room here tonight... Can any of you put your hand up and say, never ever once in your whole life have you ever bullied anyone? I'd like to see the hands. Do you mean bad people or any people? Any people. <laughs> 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 any people. <laughs> any. So let's own it for a start. Bullies aren't people out there, okay? Bullies are us. We bully all of us some of the time. And, you know... Sometimes it's appropriate to get up and really be a bit tough and difficult. Sometimes it is. Sometimes it isn't. You should bully if you're going to do it, and hey, I do it a lot, um, on an individual basis, never on a group basis. That's the way I see it. And I think maybe that's why the media is so bad, because they tend to do it according to stereotypes, and that's where it gets really difficult. But let's not be too pious about yeah. our own Sim, Sim, what's your take on that? I, I think that, um, let's face it, the media is market driven and if what the media was showing us wasn't something that the majority of the community related to, it would be very quickly taken away. 